If you think you're secure, you're kidding yourselves. Hi everyone, I'm John Palladino. I'm the VP of Client Services for Intersystems. We're a software company worldwide, but enough about Intersystems. I wanna talk about security. So one of the things I'm responsible for is corporate security, and I'm also responsible for IT. And I just wanna say, if you think you're secure, you're kidding yourselves. We all have to be on guard and making sure we're advancing from a technological standpoint, a preparation standpoint, a business standpoint, and a response standpoint. So what I see, not just within our client base, but I see this happening with the reports I'm getting about incidents around the world. People aren't paying attention to security as much as we should be. So simple things like multi-factor authentication, that's not the cure-all to protect you from a threat, but it's a start, and I'm surprised at how many organizations don't even have two-factor authentication. Credentials get stolen all the time. Happens everywhere. And passwords are also very important. So if you have a weak password policy, you need to change it. Because passwords are easy to guess, and there are tools out there that enable the bad guys to guess passwords much more effectively than you might think. Next is having an EDR. What is an EDR? It's extended defense. So you probably have antivirus, but do you have something that's watching your network and looking for behaviors? There are lots of EDR products out there and they're all pretty good. So you should be looking for an EDR and getting that deployed. Some organizations are doing these things. So my message is to the organizations that aren't, and unfortunately, there are a lot of those. In addition to that, do you have an agreement, a relationship with a cybersecurity company? Do you have an agreement? Do you have somebody watching your network, watching for security events, which by the way, are happening all the time that aren't necessarily threats, but having an outside security operations center or a SOC is really important. You don't have to build one yourself, although you could, but there are plenty of cybersecurity organizations out there that can help you immediately.